Hi, John Valvano, and in this video, I'd like to introduce Lab 7. Okay, um, as always, uh, the reading for Lab 7 will be Chapter 7 in the book, and we've uh, collected a new ebook, Chapter 17, which has the videos and readings you can do specifically for Lab 7. Uh, of course, uh, it makes a lot of sense to read the actual assignment uh, so that you can clarify exactly what's done. So in this video, what I want to do is talk about the circuit. I'm going to um, uh, outline the starter code, show you the files and the structures, and in particular look at um, three different um, uh, pieces of software. The io.c that you have to write, the lcd.s, and the prints. Okay, let's get started. Okay, here's the starter um, project for Lab 7. Okay, and I'd like to outline, first of all, we'll start with the uh, overall picture, and that is the main program, which has actually been written for you, uh, that will test the whole system. But there's a couple of low-level things that you have to do. Uh, let's begin with the lowest level. And this is the serial port, uh, busy weight interaction between your software and the LCD. And you have to write now these two functions here. You have to write uh, write command uh, following these six steps in assembly language, uh, ARM architecture procedure call standard, and you have to write uh, the software write data using these four steps specifically. Again, it uses busy weight um, synchronization. The next highest level software is something you don't have to write. And so this is a fairly large file. Uh, you can see that it's uh, 1,600 lines. And in particular, what it does is um, handle the middle level of the LCD. Of particular, uh, in this file, you can see the wiring diagrams, depending upon which version of the ST7735 you've already had. Uh, when we get to lab 10, uh, you're going to see that there's um, the, the font table here. Uh, it exists, and in particular, it has uh, some of the foreign characters um, that will make fun for doing uh, lab uh, 10. All right. Um, this middle level calls your low level. And then on top of that is the highest level. Uh, is This is the highest level. And in here, you're going to write two more um, assembly language functions, uh, and that is out deck and out fix. And you heard about those in the regular lecture. But what I'd like to show you here is how we uh, connect the devices. And so this module needs to call the C program out care, and so it will import the label. It will need to output uh, out string, call out string, and so it'll import it. On the other hand, the other programs need to execute functions within here, so we'll export those. Okay, so between import, which allows you to call, and export, which allows other to call you, this is how we're going to connect the modules. And this one uh, is the one that has um, has the local variables in it and uh, calculates uh, a number to it, uh, outputting it as an ASCII string uh, to the device. Okay, all right. Then the highest level is the main program here, and uh, it you basically is a, is a static test, which will test these particular devices, um, and by calling your uh, out deck and your out fix here. You see there's one more uh, fairly simple uh, set of drivers you have to write called I.O. Uh, this basically uses the port um, F bit 4 as the input and port F bit 2 as the output and port F bit 2 will be a heartbeat and port F bit 4 will be allow you to touch. So you're going to write these three functions. They're not that uh, complicated. Okay, so in summary, the hardware is fairly simple. Uh, the software is actually not that complicated. Uh, and so do it in steps, uh, do a little bit and test it. All right, in the next video, we'll show you how to uh, get started on the ST7735.